Yeah, local religious leaders from across the state are coming to Green Bay for a two-day conference on safety and security. Chris Schuler reports this conference is about keeping congregations safe while in a house of worship. Last October, a man allegedly opened fire inside a synagogue in Pennsylvania during service, killing 11 people. A horrible crime that NWTC's Jason Weber wants to prevent here in Northeast Wisconsin. I think every time something like this happens, it really kind of hits a little bit closer to home. Weber is one of the organizers of the college's House of Worship Safety and Security Conference, a two-day seminar starting Tuesday at the Tundra Lodge filled with information on how to keep congregations safe. Churches are really unique in that um, they're gathering points, you know, and they're, they're what we call a soft target. The second annual conference was started after church shootings across the country, like the Sikh Temple Massacre in Oak Creek in 2012 that left six people dead. The goal is to help churches secure their facilities, learn how to identify a threat, and to develop a plan of action to any incident. Help people prepare, help people plan, get people thinking about this. You can tell some of the shootings that occurred in, throughout the country. Uh, it wasn't a topic that anybody ever thought about. Tim Decker is the safety and security team leader for his church in Bellevue. His team is attending the conference to learn best practices used by over 200 attendees. People should feel safe in a house of worship. You just can't pass it off as if it's not going to happen to us because you just never know. Obviously, we all want to pray that this doesn't happen, but uh, it really is nice to have kind of a game plan or at least an idea in the event it does. Reporting in Brown County, Chris Schuler, Local 5 News. And you can find more information on registration at our website, wearegreenbay.com.